boys and girls. So we've been working on contractions in our grammar time. Um, and you guys are familiar now with the fact that contractions are two words squished together into one that represent more of how we speak. And so we can use them in our writing as well. Um, when we use them in writing and we're combining these two words, we kind of kick out a few letters. And the great part is, is that instead of writing those letters out, we instead get to use something called the apostrophe. You guys are familiar with this at this point. Remember, we don't call it a floating comma. It's totally different from a comma. It's not the same thing. Okay, it's an apostrophe. It goes in place of those letters that we have taken out. So we're gonna go ahead and watch my favorite um, vocabulary video of contractions. And then I'm gonna show you the magic squares that you have to do with contractions. We're gonna go ahead and pause there because I know that we've seen this video a few times and I wanna make sure that I have a moment to share with you guys what the magic squares are that you are doing, okay? So magic squares are pretty simple. Um, what you're going to do is when you pull this up on Canvas, it'll just be on your screen um, and you are going to match the puzzle pieces together into this box, okay? So for example, if I start with wait, this one, he has some different words on each side. He has where'll, where's, how will, and that'll. I need to find one that matches up with this. So if I need how will, this one is howl, and I can put that right there. And then I need above here, where will. So if I see one at the bottom that says where will, I can match him there, okay? Um, but here I need we will, okay? So as you can tell that I'm matching them up so that each of the sides is complete and matches. Uh, you might end up in a situation, so like let's look here, we have weed, so I need we would, and where's where is. So luckily these match, but we might end up in a spot where it doesn't and you have to move everything all around because maybe this whole piece actually needs to be down here on my screen, okay? It is tricky, it's hard, all right? Have fun with it, try your best. If you don't get it after trying for like 20 minutes, don't worry about it, okay? It's just some practice for you to um, really challenge your brain, okay? All right, guys, have fun.